Good morning, brothers and sisters in Christ. And when I say brothers and sisters, I mean brothers and sisters in the in the truest sense of the the phrase. Crispin and I are here in our little library, and we have a brief message for you. And that message is, we love you. We love you so very much, and we miss you. When I say that you are my true family, my real family, I mean that. I truly mean that from the bottom of my heart. We so look forward to seeing you in the near future. We hope that comes about as quickly as possible. We pray for that every day. Brothers and sisters, as we go through this uh, coronavirus pandemic together, let's please remember the words of Romans 8.28. All things, all things work together for the good of those who love God and are called according to his purpose. All things. And that means even this virus situation. Please also remember that God is with you. He will never leave you nor forsake you. God has promised that you are his now and forevermore. And my goodness, if we can't rest secure in that, well, we just can't rest secure. But we are secure in the palm of his hands. We pray for you daily. We ask for your patience. And we also ask that you take time every day, as we do, to look through our directory and pray for each person individually. Just take that time. We have that time. Once again, we love you. We miss you. And we so can't wait to see you. May the mercy and grace and peace of God be with you now and forevermore. And the people of God said, Amen.